um, Prophet T.B. Joshua, who is a great man of God, who is in the presence of God. There are so many pastors calling late Prophet T.B. Joshua as a fake prophet. And in this video, Prophet Tulobi warns Arame Osei and other ministers calling T.B. Joshua a fake prophet to stop. Let us listen as Prophet Lovey explains and warns other ministers to stop calling T.B. Joshua a fake prophet. God hiding you is that when the enemy thinks you're in a certain location, he comes, he doesn't find you, huh? Yes. Comes to another location, they don't find you. They realize you are, you are more supernatural than them. They say, this one, we can't find them. They're in the secret place. Let's leave them alone. Wow. Wow. We know their physical location, but every time we go, we can't find them. Many of you want muscle. You know one thing about God, I realized. I was talking to my little sister, Eva, and I was talking about one of the fathers. I was speaking about uh, Prophet T.B. Joshua, who is a great man of God, who is in the presence of God. Great man of God. See, the problem is many operate with what she say, he say, who said, he say. T.B. Joshua will always be the greatest prophet of his time. 100%. And somebody has to be out of their mind to say otherwise. Let's stop talking about people we don't know. Let's stop this second-hand information. It's dangerous. It's dangerous. It's a very bad thing. Many will get themselves in trouble with God and they don't understand what they are doing. God's defense is always in silence. If God makes his defense publicly, there are souls that will perish. God is not interested in killing people, even though he can. As Prophet Olobi warns everyone to stop calling Prophet T.B. Joshua a fake prophet. As Christians, we also need to understand that the Bible says we shouldn't judge anyone. You see, we should remember the account when Moses had to marry a different woman and his siblings sent him before God. We all saw what God did to Miriam. Bible says, let's remember, let God deal with their own ministers. We don't have the right as Christians to judge. Anytime we judge, the Bible says we will also be judged. We also what um, what lobby just said. We also what prophet lobby just said. He says that he sees him as a full prophet. He sees him as a man of God. And any minister who say he's not a man of God is out of his mind. Thank God for his saying that this is what ministers of God needs to do. We have to talk good about each other. We shouldn't stand on a pulpit and condemn each other. Let's remember, let love reign. That's what God wants us to be. Jesus Christ said that let us be one. Let them be one as we are one. Church of God, and family thank you very much for watching the video i believe you all heard what prophet lobby just said let us remember this god will bless you and i'll see you in the next video bye bye